Abdul, tell me more about your brand and the product. Assalamu alaikum. Um, I'm originally from Damascus, the city of Jasmine. So this is where the idea uh, revolved and developed over time. Uh, I established my business about seven years ago. Um, alhamdulillah, I studied, I studied perfumery as well with a master perfumer and I became certified perfumer on top of my qualifications as well. Um, I, love, I love perfume as a passion, um, so this is how it started. And it's still, it's like a passion for me. I love blending fragrances. I love this beautiful world. Yeah. Uh, of, of course, you know, it, it reminds me of back home. Wherever you go in Damascus, uh, in the old city, in the old bazaars, you smell jasmine and roses. So um, this is where the, the, the idea came from. And then actually, I made my brand as Monarch Garden. Uh, with butterfly logo to represent the royalty and represent the freshness of a butterfly where where, where it you know jumps from a, a, a flower to another flower in the garden um, so I've got um, alhamdulillah really big range of hand blend fragrances um, and then I go to events and festivals and this is this festival is really outstanding the service is amazing the the there's so many cultures so many backgrounds you know, integrating with it, each other. It's not I believe this festival is one of the biggest is, in, in the biggest London and Europe as well. Yeah, yeah, in in London, and it's going to uh, soon. I would say around the world, and yeah. and so in terms of the fragrances, uh, how many of them you have created yourself? It's like your own sort of um, work. I've created about ten to fifteen different fragrances: floral, fresh, and oud. Yeah, mostly oud because uh, of Arab culture as well. We love oud. And on top of that, I blend oud with jasmine yeah. because of uh, blood that you know uh, that is actually um, inherited yeah. from 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 great great parents and, and family. Abdul, in terms of the the business, you have a high street or anywhere shop as well, or it's only online at the moment? Uh, at the moment, it's only online, yeah. to be honest, because um, it's online. You have more flexibility to have to have a shop, and then with this 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 time, um, it's really expensive to to to, yeah. to open a shop and physical shop. Although for fragrances, it's it's much much better to have a, a physical exposure to business to, yeah. to 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 individuals and and perfume lovers. You can't really sell perfume online because it doesn't have a um, life, doesn't have spirit. Mm. Whereas also you, you can't sometimes you can't really afford having a big shop in high streets because it's, it's overwhelming in terms of the business rate, in terms of rent, in terms of, yeah. of other things, you know, that is associated with, with renting. Let's give the, the, the audience a few tips when they go out to buy perfume, what they should be looking for when they do. And is there any main tip that this is what they should be looking for when they buy a good perfume, what they should know definitely, about it? Definitely. First thing, try to avoid uh, synthetic. Uh, ingredients. Uh, try to avoid uh, commercial uh, ingredients yeah. because they are um, they can cause cancer. They can cause yeah. health issues, especially when it's associated with your skin, uh, associated with your, um, I mean, uh, breathing system. Uh, it really affects your breathing system sometimes because it's you are actually inhaling yeah. the 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 horrible sometimes horrible yeah. uh, particles. Yeah. Um, try to buy uh, eau de parfum uh, or extract because there is a uh, big concentration in oil. Yeah. Uh, or you try, you try, you blend your own fragrances yeah. by any means. You try to get some essential oils from uh, reputable suppliers yeah. and try to blend it and exercise because yeah. it's a beautiful, very appealing. Um, yeah. I mean. Life project, you yeah. can say, and it's ent entertainment as well to blend your own fragrance. Mm. Get some jasmine, get some a rose, blend some sandalwood, and see how it develops. Yeah. Uh, but as I said, some tips I can I can always um, give is eau de parfum. Yeah. Try to avoid commercial and cheap perfumes yeah. or cosmetics, even yes. though because yes. this is your body, you need to treat it well. Yeah. Um, and that's all really. It's, it's uh, and. Don't be mean. Yeah. Spend some some money. <laughs> I, it definitely is one of the main things that it comes when you buy the good perfume. It's yeah. it comes with a price tag, and yeah. mostly people think like, oh, I'm paying 140 pound for this, but that makes sense. So it it's does, not always yes. yeah. because expensive um, perfumes uh, is always linked with 
reputation. Yeah. So like big brands like Gucci and Yves Saint Laurent and, and um, uh, Louis Vuitton, they can't really uh, risk their reputation. So yeah. it has to be tested, has to, to have uh, essential oils and natural oils yeah. as well, on top of the uh, synthetic oils. Because sometimes, uh, as a perfume maker, you can't really always get uh, natural oils um, from from nature. Because yeah. whether it's nat whether it's rare, whether it's so expensive to blend, whether it's delicate, you can't really extract from nature. So laboratories are getting involved in this um, process. But uh, as I said, sometimes the prices don't reflect quality yeah. uh, because it, you're paying for for other 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 uh, yeah. other as, other things as well uh, yeah. on top yeah. of the. the well, brand. It's, it's amazing. I can see lots of products, and I'll definitely show it to you guys, and you guys can actually visit them on social media and uh, get get the product and test them and leave your feedback and comments, Abdul. And if you guys find anything good, then continue to purchase them. Support the business that's run by the our brothers and sisters and and that's that's how we can support our community